This is the second video of how to sign a PDF. The first video was done by sending an email uh, through AOL, which when you open the email, it opens up in um, Adobe Reader, which is a different format. When you send an email to a Google account, a Gmail account, it opens up and gives you various choices. I've already sent the email to a Gmail account and um, we will be using the Doc Hub signing of a PDF. Okay, we have our file. Um, here's our file. You will click here and then it asks you uh, open with uh, Doc Hub. Now, um here it should act okay so it's telling me that this file has been created sent and signed before um, and to save the um, five sample files that they give you that you can use within 30 days I'm just going to go ahead and use the old file. So we're going to open an existing file and we have the file. Now when we go to uh, our menu bar on the top you want to choose sign. Uh, now I have several signatures in here so if it's not the person who is signing we can do a management and delete all old signatures. Right? Once you have that, you can send a new signature, and uh, we will draw the signature. You have other choices. Take a picture uh, and send it from your phone, or transmit it from your phone, upload an image from within your computer, or just plain type it out. So I'm going to go with the uh, draw portion, and we're going to have Mr. John. Now, we have Mr. Bull's signature, we save it. Now, um, we're going to go over here and just look for a place to place his signature. Okay, let's say uh, Mr. Bull has to we just about use all the spaces on here. Uh, we're just going to put Mr. Bull right next to Mr. John Doe Ramey. So we go, we click on signature, we pull Mr. Bull's signature, and we can place it up here. And then we can enlarge Mr. Bull's signature. Right? And now we need a uh, date next to Mr. Bull's signature. So we go back up here and we will choose today's date and we will just place it right next to the signature. Otherwise, the date will be placed over here on the line. Um, now we have Mr. Bull's signature in. If we needed a second signature, we would repeat the process. Um, we can create a new signature and that new signature will be Mary. Uh, Lou. So we would go Mary oh, Let's just say Mary Lou doesn't like that. Mary Lou is going to type her signature. Right? So Mary Lou would type her signature by saying Mary Right? And now you know that the difference is uh, with the Adobe, it gives you four choices from within uh, choice of four. Mary Lou's gives you uh, 
various choices and style. So we we'll choose this one from the area code. We need to send the file out. That's basically all we do. We just go to the top button, send. We want to send it in an attached email and we want to send it back to the sender. Okay, we have signatures. We have Mr. John Paul. We have uh, Mary Lou here and the dates. So that concludes our um, topic of how to sign uh, PDFs using um, the Doc Hub processor.